dear friends in Jesus Christ today the holy mother church invites us to reflect upon the gospel of saint john chapter 3 verses 31 to 36 john begins this passage by asserting the supremacy of jesus the peculiar authority of revelation through the son is clarified here strictly speaking there is no revelation by the son as though it originated in him rather in christ we see the revelation of the father jesus unprecedented possession of the holy spirit of revelation must be interpreted in terms of his unique relation to the holy spirit this christological dimension is evident from redemptive action of the father in and through the son which reaches its climax in the crucifixion and resurrection the revelation of god in christ is in word and deed and is conditioned by the mysteries of the incarnation and trinity god the father who provides the spirit unconditionally has shown humans the path of eternal life through his only begotten son the faithful who place their feet in this path of salvation through baptism how to respond positively to the activities of holy spirit and one needs to keep on going until he reaches the perfection of salvation one must fill his life with the fruits of holy spirit every christian has an important role to put his all hearted effort to build up a holy world here on earth as we are getting ready to receive the infant jesus in the crib of heart let us thank the father who was ever ready to give his only son for our salvation let us put all our trust in jesus christ thereby let all of us become heirs of eternal life amen